Harry Jones may have never even touched his gun. Harry Jones may have never even touched his gun. Rogers sitting at home while he waits on the trial. Rogers sitting at home while he waits on the trial. Rogers hiding behind the stand to a ground law. Roger is hiding behind the stand your ground law. Jones played in his band the night of his death. Jones played in his band the night of his death. Roger wasn't supposed to be working that night. Roger wasn't supposed to be working that night. Adam T. recorded the last phone call from Corey Jones. Adam T. recorded the last phone call from Corey Jones. Roger's version of events very iffy. Before the recordings of Jones's last moments were recovered, the only story that anyone had was Roger's version of events. He claimed that he approached the vehicle without his protective vest, badge, department-issued handgun, or radio, all things that a plainclothes cop is supposed to use in such a situation. He told investigators, I didn't think there was anybody in there. And as I got close to the vehicle and up, uh, the door swung open and up. Uh, he continued, saying that Jones caught him with his pants down. According to Jones, the moment he mentioned he was a police officer, Jones drew a gun on him and at that point, it was a do or die scenario. Hey guys, thank you so much for the support and likes and comments down below and also thank you so much for watching and I look forward to see you in the next video then. Take care. Bye.